On Monday's installment of BBC Breakfast, presenter John Kay discussed the historic coronation happening next month with the chief executive of the campaign group Republic. During their conversation, Graham Smith shared his beliefs that the majority of the British public has no interest in the coronation due to its high cost in the middle of a cost-of-living crisis. As preparations for King Charles's coronation next month are in full swing, the nation is getting ready to celebrate the historic event across the first weekend of May. Although, according to Graham, a minority of the population have an interest in the occasion as he told BBC Breakfast's John's support for the monarchy has dropped. Revealing some figures show there's increasing support for abolition, Graham branded the whole coronation pointless. He commented, this is not a national celebration, I mean the coronation itself is pointless. Clive Owen gives update on kids as he admits split is tough it is a pointless parade. It's going to cost us anything between 50 to 100 million pounds. It won't achieve a single thing because he's already king, it is a minority interest. Interjecting, John questioned, it's history. It's living history isn't it? Although the Republic executive argued everything people do in their lives is technically living history. He added, we can very easily not do coronations, in European monarchies they decided they were out of date and pointless 150 years ago. Throwing 100 million pounds pounds at a pointless parade when people are struggling. Graham told John the high cost of the royal event will be hard for some people to accept when the UK is in the middle of a cost-of-living crisis. He continued, people at work are struggling to make ends meet and struggling to put food on the table for their kids. I think it is pretty appalling and I think that may be one of the reasons why interest has dipped under 10%. People look at this and think, what the hell are we spending our money on? Don't miss. Rylan Clark shares plans after quitting Strictly spin-off It Takes Two, latest, Ken Bruce admits exits are never tidy as he touches on BBC dispute, latest, The Crown's James Murray on reason he jumped at Prince Andrew role, latest, this parade when so many people are struggling with the cost of living crisis. The coronation, which will happen at Westminster Abbey on May 6, is set to be a more slimmed-down occasion compared to the late Queen's which happened in the 1950s. Speaking about the cost of the coronation, Cabinet Office Minister Oliver Dowden said both the King and government are mindful to ensure there is value for the taxpayer across the celebrations. He told The Mirror, these are moments in the life of our nation. They bring joy to millions of people. They also mark us out as a nation around the world, it is a marvelous moment in our history and people would not want it our scrimping and scraping. They would want an appropriate ceremony. That is what we will have. BBC Breakfast continues weekdays on BBC One from 6am.